Hey everybody, welcome into this new video. Let's talk about the three top softwares that can be helping you to manage your money, uh, to manage your small business if you are an owner or if you have like a small business and you have some team workers and you want to get started to really feel free. Or even if you have like um, a low budget and you want to get started. So there are three applications that can be helping us to improve that. And first of all, the, f the first app that I do want to talk about, this one is called Wave. Now, the web application is something really, really easy to use if you're using a small business, if you're getting started, if you don't know actually how to manage your business, if you want to create some invoices. Uh, so I do love to compare between uh, speaking about when I search into a lot of apps, I love to compare between the pricings. So speaking about the pricings of the weight application, they do have an invoicing, accounting, and buy and banking totally for free. These features are totally for free. Now, if I scroll a little bit down, we do have the payroll. This is the tax service estate, the bookkeeping support, the account and payroll coaching, and the self service estate. So. If you think that this um, invoicing free is something that can be really useful for you, the banking, the accounting, and of course the payment with low uh, commissions, you can just get, go into your account and just go and get started. Now, uh, for me, it's a little hard to use this application because Wave is built only for United States and Canada businesses. Now, in my case, I'm currently into the now America, Latin America, and I'm not pretty sure if these guys need me to create an account into Suhu Books or I just can't in get inside there. But um, speaking about the integration, speaking about the prices, Wave is a really great app to get started for a small businesses. Now, the second application that I do want to show you is called Setbooks. Now, Setbooks, um, the difference between Waves and Setbooks is that I can use Setbooks. I do have an account here into Setbooks, and I've used that into another company. I've just created a new account, but um, I just wanted to show you how this Setbook works. But first of all, let's talk about once again about the pricings. Now, speaking about the pricings, you might be saying that Waves was really for free with different uh, options, like for example, the digital payments, the unlimited vendors, and unlimited invoices. Now, if you have like a smarter plan into Setbooks, you can have the connect your multiple bank accounts, received account notifications, you can track time, and you can add five team, five team members into your into this platform. So I think. It can be really worthy to stick around with Tipbooks once you have this plan. And of course, you do have a trial version of this application. So once you hit into the trial version, here is the option to create an invoice or to go to your transactions. And here you can build to, let's say, for example, customer like this. The title, this is for free lenser services. You can input the number of your invoice, the PO, the date, what is the amount. If I want to choose, if I if it's USD dollars, and the deal, let's say for last week. And here I can add some tasks, the terms, the notes, the subtotal, the discount. If I want to add a discount, the total they paid. Here is my estimate, the recurring profile. So if you see like a star, that means that we need to have it. To upgrade our account but if you want to like do some reports about what you're doing here into set books if you want to add your people in here into reports and just see what is the income and statement for example like the profit and the lows here as you can see the sales expenses the other revenue the other expenses a really really easy app to use and i can export this of course if i want to do but once again i do need to have the upgrade in order to use this now, um, the last application that I do want to show you, this one is called Accounting with K. Now, accounting can be helping us once again with some inventories, with some sales, with the purchases we're making to connect a few bankings, and of course, to do exactly as we just did before to see our reportings. So, once again, I do want to check it out what are the plans available into accounting. And as you can see, they do have something a little bit more higher than the set books, 
but once again as I just told you into a in other videos that I have into this channel I don't want to focus into the price I don't want to focus into the value of, of what does the app has to offer to us so speaking about free plan we do have one user for application included we have the community support which I think it's nothing <laughs> but speaking about the premium cloud we have 10 companies 10 users 10 apps a ticket support a double entry bank feeds expenses claims roles permissions and client portal so uh, I think that I would love to stick around with something more like to for example stripes my CRM inventory projects payroll and this is just available for the elite uh, cloud so this elite cloud is a $58 I think it can be worthy if we have all of this available into just one plan and of course we do have 30 companies and 30 users so uh, 58 30 times this one I think it's like really really worthy if I do have a strong and really not that small company and the last part the most amazing part of when we create an account is to check it out the features now Speaking about the features of accounting, accounting can be helping us to decide to manage our finances, to check it out, the flash flow, the invoicing, accepting online payments, keep tracking of expenses. And of course, this is totally for free, which I think is life, really, really lifesaver. But here to have, for example, bank accounts, we do have a multi-company. So multi-company are to assign some users to different companies. Like if you are running out, for example, YouTube account, you are running out uh, my company from one website into another one. If I have my bank account, if I do have like an e-commerce account, like one Shopify or two Shopify um, stores. So it's really, really helpful to have the multi-company. We have the powerful reporting, the recall everything, the client portal, and the customer summary. So there are a lot of options to check it out. For example, the tax rate, which I think that can be really useful for me to check it out. How much are they going to be charging me per transaction? Because sometimes they do take like a few commissions for that. But here they have data ownership, the 100%. So for that, you want to scroll a little bit down into your resources and here into the resources you want to check it out like the free tools and how much are they charging for estimates and all that. So here is estimate quotes, let's stick around with the free tools and let's see what do we have available into just only the free version. But this is uh, specifically speaking about for small businesses. I think that this app can be really, really worthy if you know how to use this apps. If you have a company, more than one company and more than 30 persons working into just one project, which I think can be really useful for us. And speaking about the price, it can really be, really, really get, be much valuable, can be really bring, uh, bring a lot of value into our company. So that totally depends on what position is your business. So hopefully guys, this was a very useful video for you. Now, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you do want to see more great apps so you can start with your small business. Thank you once again for watching the video guys and I will see you on the next video. See you soon.